Today it's Monday, September 16, 2024. This is M157 out of a CLS 63. And what I'm doing now, what I'm doing all the time, I need to get the main bearings, put it on, use the plastic gauge, check, wash again for final and start putting it together. Now that's how that looks like from down. All right. This how that looks like from up. There you go. All right. Let's start working. These crank bearing caps and this timing cover is for the other block that's uh, machine shop. This belongs to this block. That's why I have it far away. I need the used bolts to torque it down to check with the plastic gates and then the final is gonna be with the new bolts lagging at the time. Cranks after it's over there. Stop talking, start working. I'm, I'm not gonna show you in details. Go watch a previous video. I've mentioned this one million times. I'm gonna show you how it's gonna be with the crankshaft and then with the pistons and step by step. Not step by step. Installed, I'm talking about. You'll gonna see. Let's make one video before I put the piston on the notes. Piston connecting nuts, they are con uh, piston gap done, uh, connecting bearings done, crankshaft in place with the new bolts torqued down. I'm not making it upside down and classic like any other time. One second, it makes 360. Twenty-two degrees Celsius. The block. Actually, this is how much I have here inside the engine room, 22 degrees. Okay, it makes 360. You see the assembly grease on it. All right, now it's time to put oil on the cylinders because they're dry and start installing the pistons. And that's it. I'm calling it a day. Tomorrow, the rest. Most probably gonna be a small video. <laughs> okay, why I'm saying that? Because I get also the tool to see the small end, the big end, I check everything. Yeah, like any other time, I just didn't put on the video. I have a music. Yeah, it's gonna have a copyright if I leave it playing. So I'm gonna continue with my music and putting it together, the engine. All piece connected nodes in place. Bank one, bank two. Now it's the time to stretch the bolts. All right, let's spin also the engine. Uh, no, it's not the time to stretch the bolts. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Okay, one second, one second. I'll gonna explain. Lovely. Nice. I don't want to bite anywhere. Lovely. Now, what's the time now? It's not the time now to stretch the bolts. I'm making a mistake, dang it. Upside down, checking the clearance for the cooling jets. Make sure that it doesn't have any contact. It's not gonna have any contact. I just wanna see if it's near to, uh, to the connector or to any piston. All right, from down here. There, it's a cooling jet down over there, okay? So, need to check the clearance for the cooling jets. Then I'm gonna set the, the bolts, all right? And then, then I'm gonna make sure that, like any other time, that each piston is reaching at top dead center equal. 
that means it's not coming one more out or more down like the previous M157s. Exactly the same setup. I haven't changed the setup. All right. Let's do that and finish the video. The rest tomorrow, not today. And number eight, the last cylinder. Zero and one two thousand on one millimeter. Not a big deal. No, almost zero. Lovely. All of them the same. Like any other time. It makes my life much more easy. All right, now, tomorrow, continue tomorrow, not today. Let me cover the engine. And moving on tomorrow. It should be short video. But it should be short video because I have the same video. I don't remember how many times. All right. Thank you very much. Over and out.